Hey guys, what's up? I got another uh, Pokemon Showdown match for you. This time it's an OU match. And this was an actually a pretty epic battle. Pretty epic ending. So stick around to the end. It'll be worth it, trust me. Okay, so I lead with Ferrothorn. He leads with Fortress. Um, and I play this incredibly badly because he's more in a position to set up than I am. So he sets up his two spikes and then rapid I knew he was going to rapid spin out my hazards. So that's why I tried to make bait him out into switching out into his fortress, but he's not even phased, so he just gets all three of his spikes up. So that was a big mistake. I go into I didn't want to go for flamethrower cuz that was obvious, so I went to shadow ball and it actually worked out because he switches into Jellicent, but then he switches into Hydreigon just so that um, you know, he can make me switch out because I'm Choice Scarf and I was locked into Shadow Ball. But now I go into Ferrothorn and I want to get my rocks up again for the battle. And uh, I also wanted to paralyze the Hydreigon and basically use Ferrothorn until he died. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So he, uh, Ferrothorn dies going to Latios and because I know I'd be able to outspeed him. And I know Latios would probably outspeed the Jellicent too, so I have Thunderbolt on the Latios. So I went for that. And I was thinking about switching after he went into Heat Ram, but I decided to just stay in. And it looks like he has the Hidden Power Ice. And then he actually, he absolutely destroys me here. He baits me into using Thunderbolt again and goes into Electivire. And he has the Moto Drive or whatever it is. And he now his speed is 1.5, so he takes me out with Ice Punch. And then he's able to outspeed my choice scarf Chandler, and that really sucks. And then I have a, I, I, you know, because I'm stupid, I go into Haxorus, and he just ice punches me and takes me out again. Um, but I go into my Keldeo, and Keldeo's able to outspeed it. I hit it with a secret sword, and he kills me off with a, with a, whatever, wild charge, and then the recoil kills him. So now I only have Balloon, right? So I put his fortress to sleep so I can get a few bulk ups. And I want to have a lot of attack and a lot of defense. Just so that I so I have a chance at winning this match. So he actually wakes up and I decide to put him to sleep again so I can have one more bulk up. And I was like, okay, I can I can do one more bulk up and I'll be set and I'll be set. But I I didn't I thought he would stay in, but he switches into heat trend and I'm like, oh it's game over now. But he misses the Magma Storm. Drain Punch is easily going to take it out. Now he goes into Fortress. And he's asleep. So I'm like, okay, let's just go for one more bulk up for good measure. He's asleep. And a times three Drain Punch from a Berloom Fortress lives that like a champ. So you, that just shows how much of a beast Fortress is. Su uh, Seed Bomb is easily going to take out Swampert. And yeah, I mean, that was a pretty epic battle. I mean, if you stay to the end, awesome. You guys are awesome. And whoops, my bad. Um, anyway, yeah, I mean, it was an awesome battle. Um, uh, props to that guy. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, peace out.